today from your girl, Dr. Amai, on the social justice table. Let's look at when the land parceling started. We need to be honest when we're tackling such issues. Land parceling started when Chobo and Kasukwere were ministers of local government. Truth need to be said. We cannot blame people right now because of these naughty former ministers. Chombo is in and out of the courts. As a citizen, I'm concerned and I'm frustrated because I don't see whether the state is winning those cases against Chombo or it's just a mere waste of state resources. The state needs to move fast. We need justice. Look at Kasukwere. Kasukwere is enjoying in the comfort of South Africa. But we have got people like Lamek Muchena who apparently paid all the money and were promised the title deeds after paying all the money for the pieces of land. Lamek Muchena paid all that money. After paying all that money, he was told that the title deeds for the land have been issued to Datrons. The same Datrons evicted Lamek Muchena last week. Lamek Muchena, as we are speaking, he is living in a tent in Zimbabwe. Yet he pumped out the money, full money for the piece of land, for the stand. We cannot have Kasukwere dodging the law. The Zimbabwean government has got a relationship with the South African government. Zimbabwean government need to fast track bringing Kasukwere back home. He must account. He was issuing out orders to civil servants to issue out the, the title deeds for land and to give several people pieces of land. Because if you check, Chombo and Kasukwere have got pieces of land or stands in many places that they acquired while they were ministers of local government. So as Zimbabweans, we cannot allow that to happen. This is not the kind of Zimbabwe that we want. I'm challenging the law enforcers. Bring back Kasukwere to Zimbabwe as a matter of like yesterday. Bring him back. He must account. We cannot have our citizens being evicted day and night. Civil servants are now being arrested in and out of the courts. A Blawayo residence, Harare residence, all suffering because of two naughty ex-ministers. We can't have that Zimbabwe. I challenge all of you to stand against these two naughty ex-ministers. Uh,